Hey guys, welcome back to Case Place. My name is Dana. Welcome back to all of my current subscribers. And for all of you who aren't subscribed, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button. So as the title says, I do have a Dollar Tree haul. And at the end of this video, I will announce the winner of my 100 subscriber giveaway. So let me get into this haul so we can get to that winner at the end. So I have a very few food, food items and then most everything else is just some, I have quite a few new things and then some Christmas stuff too. So I did find my store had quite a few of the sweet tasty cake things. So we decided to try some of these. So I picked up two of the iced tasty cake honey buns. These are huge by the way. These are a six ounce honey bun and these don't expire till January the 11th of 2018. These are right here have the price printed on them. These are regularly a dollar and 79 cents. These are big guys. These are huge honey buns. What's those things? So I picked those up for my husband. Picked up two of those. I was afraid to pick up any more of them. I was like, oh my gosh, will it be the size of a house? And then I picked him up some of these chocolate bells. I guess these kind of remind me of Ding Dong from Hostess. And these also did not expire until the expiration date on these was also January 15th of 2018. And these were also $1.79. And these, the net weight on these was 3.5 ounces. So these are just some pretty good sized snack cakes. So I picked up two of these as well for him to try. And then I picked these up for myself. I saw the Raisinette, and they also had the Nestle Crunch snack mix. And these have milk chocolate raisins, peanuts, shredded, and shredded coconut in them. And I know these are normally like almost two dollars, at least a dollar ninety-nine, or two over two dollars at the store. So I went. I've been wanting to try them, and these are a two point five ounce little bag. So I picked these up for me to try. So that was all the food I actually got this time around. And then I picked up some like household type items. I picked up, this is a definite repurchase for us. I use this to clean with all the time. This is the Spick and Span Everyday Antibacterial Spray Cleaner. And this is the 22 fluid ounce bottle. Usually I purchased the refill for mine, but they didn't have that. So I went ahead and picked the spray bottle back up. So got that. It's in the, um, it's a citrusy kind of, um, kind of smell. Fresh citrus scent. Kills bacteria and viruses. I love this for my kitchen. I use it in my kitchen and my bathroom. I love this stuff. So, then I picked up this, sorry about that, yeah, I'm gonna move over here for a second. Mm, sorry about that. Then I picked up this VO5 Men's 3-in-1 Fresh Energy Shampoo, Conditioner, and Body Wash for my son. I'm here to tell you this boy uses body wash like it is water. So I picked this up. This is in the Fresh Energy. And it smells really good. So I went ahead and picked up two of those for him. And then I also picked up in the VO5, it says the bonus size 20% more, and it is a 15 fluid ounce bottle. I also picked up in the 20% more, the VO5 Men's 3-in-1 Ocean Surge Shampoo, Conditioner, and Body Wash. And it's, it's the five vitamin formula as well in the 15 fluid ounce bottle. And this one smelled really good too. I liked both of these. So I went ahead and picked up both of those. And then I had seen, sorry about that, put these over here and then couldn't reach them. I had seen Pretty and Flawed haul these before, and I had never seen them at my Dollar Tree. And it says that these are comparable to the um, Summer's Eve cloths, so I wanted to give them a try. These are the Maxi Thins Feminine Cleansing Cloths for Sensitive Skin with Soothing Aloe. PH balanced, alcohol-free, hypoallergenic dermatology, dermatologist tested, compares to Summer's Eve cloths, 32 cleansing cloths. So, 
went ahead and there are 32 in here. So I went ahead and picked those up to try, see how they work. And then this is something that I had never seen and I went ahead and picked up two of them. These are the Jergens Extra Moisturizing Hand Wash Cleans and Moisturizes. Moisturizing cleanser with Jergens Moisturizers and the classic cherry almond scent. I always love the smell of Jergens hand lotion, that cherry almond scent. I always thought it smelled so good. And the lotion, the hand wash smelled so good. So it's that clean kind of cherry almondy smell. So I went ahead and picked two of those up. And then I did finally find the um, rose gold colored binder clips. So I went ahead and picked up two of those, two boxes of those. These are the Jot binder clips. These are the small ones. There's an eight count. And these are the rose gold color. And so I picked up two packages of the small eight count binder clips. And then I picked up two of the rose gold small paper clips. And there are 50 of those. They're just the regular paper clips. And then these are the trombone paper clips. And these are the rose gold. And there's 15 of those. So those little cute little paper clips there. See? So cute. Oh, excuse me. And then I picked these up. I watched um, Coupon to Provide. She, um, these are made by Tobin Hardware. And they're a 60 pack of the felt pads. There are 30 of the 0.75 inch, 24 of the 1 inch, and 6 of the 1.5 inch. And she uses these. She did a tutorial on how to use these felt pads for, um, for inking in your crafts. So I picked these up for that purpose. So I went ahead and picked those up. So I'm going to give those a shot because those little ink pads that you buy, the little um, pads that you buy to do uh, like distressed inking and stuff, those are so expensive. Like 15 of them is like $7. So I went ahead and picked up these to give them a shot because the tutorial she did looks like these work pretty well. So I'm going to give them a shot and see how they work. I mean, if all else fails, they'll come in really handy for other things. <laughs> so, pick those up. And I did finally find the cute cupcake candles. They smell amazing, so I'm hoping they have a really good throw. I was hoping to catch Christy Davis's next Dollar Tree haul to see how her toasted coconut candle had smelled last night when she burned it. But apparently I missed it because I haven't heard. But this is the toasted coconut, and I love coconut. Like coconut cream pie, y'all, that's my favorite. And this smells so good. I love the smell of coconut. Oh. It just, coconut anything. Like during the summer, when you put suntan lotion on, like, mmm, I love that smell. That is my smell. So... Matter of fact, my favorite perfume is this vanilla coconut stuff that I buy at Target. Love the stuff. Comes in a little rollerball. <laughs> Love it. So, this is the toasted coconut one. And then I did find, I bought two of those. Because you gotta buy everything in twos. And then I got the red velvet cake. Mm, and it does smell just like a red velvet cupcake, y'all. Smells so good. And then there was the buttercream cupcake. It smells like icing, is all I can tell you. It smells like buttercream icing. So, mm, yummy, yummy, yummy. So, I'm hoping they have a good throw because they smell amazing. I may have to burn one tonight while I'm working on my crafts because they smell so good. So, I'll get this bag out of the way. I did finally find some mesh to work on my box, my holiday boxes that I hauled a while back, the Santa and the Snowman. So I bought, mm, sorry guys. Oh, 
Mm, sorry about that. Oh, muscle spasm. Um, I bought six of the white. And I picked up two of the green because there's a project I think that's coming up that I might need some green for. So I picked up two of the green. And I picked up three more of the red because I needed three more red. So hopefully I will have a chance to get busy and start working on those boxes. So I got those. Hmm. So I can get that out of the way. And I saw these dish towels. I'm always on the lookout for dish towels. My dish towels seem to get ruined more often than not. And like I said, I always have to buy things in twos. Don't know what that is about me, but. And this is just so cute. I thought this is the cutest dish towel. I love the colors in it. And it says, it's the little things in life. And it's like so cute and so colorful and pretty. So I got two of those and it's the one that says heavier weight and it's the cotton towels. I like those by the home collection and it's the 15 inch by 25 inch. So I got two of those. And then I hauled a, um, to make a traveler's notebook, I hauled this really pretty um, placemat a couple weeks ago. And I saw the dish towel that looks just like it. I hadn't seen it before, and I really like the dish towel. I love my coffee. And this is the coffee one that looks just like it, and it is the 15 inch by 25 inch by the Home Collection, and I really liked the dish towel. I thought it was so pretty. It's a darker color, so it won't hopefully show dirt as bad. I really liked it, so I picked up two of those for the kitchen. And then I found the little cardinal that everybody's been calling. I think he's so cute. So I picked him up because I just really liked him. I think I'm going to hang him here in the family room where he can get some sun and flutter his little wings. I've never picked up one of those little solar things, but I really liked him. So, And then I got this cute little ornament to hang on my tree. I love silver. And it is one of those little motion activated ones. Let me find his little switch here. Here it is. Is that not adorable? So, I'm going to turn that little bad boy off. I mean, close up, it doesn't look like the best in the world, but from a distance, it really doesn't look that bad, and it plays really cute music, and it's not as sensitive as some of the other ones, so I really like that. Um, I've got a swap coming up, and I'm needing some packaging, and I stink at making packaging, but these are cookie bags, and they are 15.5 inches wide by 19 inches high, by four inches in by four inches deep and they do have the round cardboard discs that you can put in the bottom if you need to and they have ribbon and they have the to and from tags which are really cute and they have the pretty little ornaments on them so if I need to I can use them for cookies or a present or whatever but my idea was to put the um, the main project that I'm making for my swap partner in here because I thought it was a really pretty bag. So, I picked that up. And I found these adorable magnets that I had seen somebody else haul on YouTube. I think it was Nicole Burgess. I really liked these. I wanted to put these on my dishwasher and my refrigerator. I liked them because they were just really, like she said, really simple. It's just the individual words. It's not a whole lot of stuff. And so I just thought it was really cute. It's just really simple red and silver. And I just really liked these. So I picked these up to put on my refrigerator and my dishwasher. And I needed some more tissue paper to finish wrapping my Christmas presents. And I could have swore at the end of Christmas last year that I picked up a ton of Christmas bags. 
on clearance at the end of the year. Can't find them anywhere. Don't know where they went. I don't know if they walked away. Don't know if I dreamt I did it. I know I picked up boxes and I could find those, so maybe that's what I thought. So I had to pick up some more bags. So I got this cute guy. He's a little penguin. If you can see on the front there, he's got some glitter. And then on the back, he's just plain. And on the side there, he's just got some little stripes. He's cute, real cute. Then my granddaughter loves minions. So I found this adorable minions bag for her Christmas, one of her Christmas presents. And then on the side, it's just red snowflakes. And I actually picked up two of those because I thought, hmm, yeah. I'll put both of her presents in there. <laughs> so, and then I found this absolutely adorable snowman. And it says, let Christmas shine in your heart. And I just thought that was so pretty. So it's kind of foiled on this side. And on this side, it's just plain. And then it's just just the plain blue in the center right there. And then I needed a bigger bag, or a couple big bags. And so I got this really pretty snowman, and it just says, tis the season. And it's the same on both sides. It's got this cute little ornament name tag. And then the side of it is just this really pretty candy cane stripe. And then I found this adorable, this is Winter Wishes, and he has this cute reindeer with a sweater on. Is he not adorable? And then the side of him is kind of like a different kind of sweater pattern. So I just thought he was really cute. He's got little pine cones hanging from his antlers. They're so cute. So then, for my, in my opinion, my score find of the day, I found some scrunchies. And these are the um, two piece scrunchies. These are the um, cloth ponytail holders. And this is the, um, if you can see, this one's kind of a shiny one, a shiny black, and kind of a, a satiny black. I would have taken more pictures of the ones that I didn't get, but I had taken pictures all through the store and then the actual district manager walked in about the time I was going to start taking pictures of these and she was like, what are you doing? So I couldn't get any pictures of the ones I didn't buy of the scunchies. So, but these are the little cloth ponytail holders. Then I picked up one of these Upzing for Secure Hold Medium Upzing Double Comb. And I've had one of these before and I really liked it. I don't remember whatever happened to it, but I have used one before and I really liked it. And this one, the only one my store had was in the black. So this is kind of stretchy. And then it's got like two hair combs on either side and it stretches across your hair to hold your hair in place are really nice and then this one here is a black with a white polka dot and then it is double sided it is a black velvet on the other side and then this one is kind of a pinkish coral it's got the it's braided and then it's got the plasticky stuff the rubbery stuff over here to hold it in place on the other side. Then I picked up, this is a four pack and I think it's got black and I think it's got two blacks. It's got two blacks, a tan and a brown in here. And it they also have the no slip grip on there. I really like those thin ones, they work really well. Then I picked this one up. These are the um, Everyday Active Workout Chill Out Super Soft, kind of like the um, turban style. And this is a purple, I think it's 
not showing up real well on camera. It almost looks black. But this is a deep purple with a pink in the center. Really pretty. And then I picked up another one in that same style, the turban. This is a real soft charcoal gray. Real soft gray with a real pale pink in the center. And again, it's that turban style. The wider ones. And then I picked up a set of just the ponytail holders, the no pull ponytail holders. And it's got this cute little ponytail holder there with the little bow. These are the extra ones that came with it. And it's got some little sparkly ones. And then these are the no damage. And this is an 18 piece with a bonus three piece. So, and these are, it's a black, pink, brown, tan. Then it's got the black the blue, the brown, the green, and then black again. Those are the colors that that one came in. So, that was my huge scunsy haul. I was really happy to find those. Because as you all know, I have nine times out of ten have my hair up in a headband. So, let me grab my bowl over here. And something to drink. Because I'm really thirsty after doing all that. I've got my little Christmas bowl here. With all my names in it. Oops, I'm gonna drop one. So, I wrote everybody's name down who signed up for my 100 subscriber giveaway. I wish really, I really wish more people would have signed up. But I guess that gives you all who did sign up a better chance of winning. So, I wrote everybody's name down on a piece of paper. I think there were 14, 15 maybe. I don't, I don't really remember. <clears throat> I wrote everybody's name down on a piece of paper. Folded them up, put them in a bowl. So, as you can see, I can't see anything in here. They're all in a bowl. Um, and I guess I could put them in a bigger bowl so that I can... Toss them around a little bit better. So here's the uh, Santa basket. I'll dump those into the big Santa basket there. So they have a bigger, wider area to move around in. So there we go. Okay, so I'm gonna shake them about. As you can see, I can't see into the basket. I'm just going to reach in here and pull out a name. And it is MB Gray Designs. So, if I remember right, that's Mary Beth. So, Mary Beth. If you want to, my email address is usually at the bottom in the description box below. So if you want to email me your address, I will get those prizes in the mail to you, hopefully tomorrow or Saturday. So congratulations, Mary Beth. I hope you enjoy everything and thanks everybody for signing up and thanks to all of my subscribers my new ones as well as my faithful loyal ones who've been with me since the very beginning I appreciate each and every one of you you have you just I say it all the time you have no idea how much I appreciate all of you thank you so much for all of you you just you have no idea how much each and every one of you guys mean to me. You truly are, I say it all the time, you guys truly are my friends and family. If I don't hear from you guys, I worry about you. If I don't see you in the comments below, I'm like, well, I wonder if they're okay. I wonder how they're doing. I wonder if everything's all right. So please make sure you guys comment below on the videos so I know you guys are okay. Now make sure nothing's happened to you. <laughs> so, like I said, for each one of my current subscribers, thank you so much for all of your continued support. I, it, it means the world to me. It really, really does. 
And for those of you who aren't currently subscribed, please consider hitting that subscribe button below. What are you waiting on? Subscribe and join our family. We really are a group of friends and family here. We support each other and we count on each other. So hit that subscribe button below. I promise you won't be sorry. So with that being said, I hope each and every one of you has, has had a wonderful Thursday and will continue to have a wonderful week and a fabulous weekend. And with that being said, I am going to hop off here and get busy because I have some work to get done for a swap that I am need to get working on. <laughs> so with that being said, I hope everyone has a wonderful what's left of their evening and be safe and be happy and I will see you guys next time down in the comments below. Let me know what you guys are on the hunt for at Dollar Tree and what you guys have found recently and I will see you guys next time. Hugs and best wishes. Bye.